What's up, muscle car people? This is. Did you just start recording? No, that was my watch. Oh my god. What's up, muscle car people? This is Bring Up Muscle Cars, and I'm Quinn. We're here today. It is December 26th, the day after Christmas, and we're up bright and early. We're ready to do some mods. We don't screw around here at Bring Up Muscle Cars. We got Matt here, we got Jared, and today we have another installment of our series of off season Fiesta modifications. Quinn's Christmas present that to he myself. Got. You hey. hang out with these guys enough, you're gonna spend some money. It is a Christmas present if you wrap it and give it to yourself. And I think they did a good job of wrapping it. What is now? What is in this box, Quinn? This is the FS Works cat back exhaust to the Fiesta. It is going to delete the resonator. It uh, comes with a muffler, but it should be a nice little give us a nice little sound, some noise, and Five whole horsepower. Yeah, it's gonna be amazing. I'm not getting five horsepower out of this. So, you might be wondering why I chose this exhaust. I am wondering. Over some other options like the mount tuner, the cob. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. Look, guys, I'm not made of money. So, is this a budget exhaust? This is a budget exhaust. Shipping and everything is about six fifty to the door, and it's all stainless. It's not any crazy, you know. Polish mirror reflection or anything Nobody's like that. Nobody's gonna see that. Exactly, it's hey, under the car. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Is the piping bigger than stuff? I believe it is. I believe we're going up to two and a half inches. We'll find out though when we get down there. Is it two, two inches stock? I think it is. Don't quote me on that though. I really don't have my uh, research done on that. Look at that. See, yeah. That's pretty nice. And this is what I don't understand guys. Like. I know people will go out and they'll spend all this money on an exhaust that you can see your reflection in. But look guys, at the end of the day, it's going underneath the car. No one's going to see it. It's just going to get dirty. How, how much was it? Uh, this was $5.85. There's like $70 shipping from California. Should have went to uh, Miles Muffler. They could have just made it for you. I know. For like 200 bucks. There are my buddies over there. Tell them I said hi. That's where our That's resonator would resonator. be. Yeah. Yep, it's just pretty much a straight pipe. Everything looks really nice. The welding looks nice. It's all stainless, which I was one of the boxes I wanted to tick off on this product because we do live in Pennsylvania here and we get salt on the roads. You know. Yeah, because you're worried about your exhaust rusting <laughs> out before you get no, you should, it. No, you should see some of my other cars. Hey, rev it up! Give it a rev! Five hundred and seventy-nine dollars. Which holy crap! You paid seventy-four dollars for shipping. That was the best option they had. It's coming from California. Wow, hey, I you asked you guys. Good. I asked you guys if that was like a lot for shipping. Yeah, that's a lot. Mm. You, you know what? Amazon free shipping. Yeah, Amazon doesn't have these products. You sure? Did you search Amazon? No. Now check that out. Let's see. That's nice. the part that you do see. They really did a nice job on. So nice. I'm really happy I with like that. It. I think that's good. We gotta cut the other exhaust off and put it next to it first. Yeah, we'll do that. I guess we are cutting. That's what Step number one, we're gonna get the car up on jack stand so we can get underneath it and get working. Alright guys, let's see how this sounds. Wait, pretty good. Go, wait, one more time. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to locate the bolts coming off the downpipe. Um, we have two 15 millimeter bolts that we're going to disconnect. We're going to spray a little bit of WD-40 or penetrating oil on our bushings here because we're going to be taking them off. And then most likely we'll be making a cut somewhere out here, I'm guessing, to pull the whole exhaust out. And uh, yeah, let's get started. I'm looking at these bolts, uh -huh. and uh, 
we'll right. see what's what the likelihood of them coming out. Go, go crazy with the fluid. Because I don't have a whole lot of faith in these coming out easily. But we have tools for that. I don't want to cut these, but I guess we might have to. Ah. Uh, Wait, they're, they're press studs into the yeah. downpipe. Just try, to, just try it again. They're already fucking like rolled. I think someone might have had an aftermarket exhaust on this thing. No, Quinn. Definitely not. I mean, I can try the 15, but it's not. It just wants to like, is there it size in between a 14 and 15? There has to be. No. Yes, there is. Look how loose that is. Okay. It's just gonna fucking roll the, the, the nut. All right, then don't use it. Use the 14. It's not, dude. It doesn't fit? No. It, I guess kinda. It doesn't really go on. Junk, not junk. So this is the stock exhaust. You can see, I don't know, it's got a weird triangle resonator there. We got this big, heavy, Muffler. Yeah, let's go side by side and do a weight comparison. They say this is a couple pounds lighter. It's got more pipe on it too. Yeah, this is definitely heavier. Not by a whole lot, but every little bit counts, right? And we can see that we have bigger pipe, larger diameter piping. That's what she said. Yeah. And uh, just looks freer flowing in general. So yeah, that's a side by side comparison there. The factory exhaust actually looks pretty good. There's no like real kinks on it. Sometimes you see where the the bends are kinked. Oh yeah, on the inside. Yeah, yeah. but otherwise it's pretty nice. It's not too bad. Yeah. We should free up some exhaust flow out of this massive 1.8 liter turbo. They did side by side dyno comparisons. It's like five wheel torque, five wheel horsepower. But you're at the really end the, gonna be able at to the end of the day, are you he's gonna, gonna, he's gonna be like, whoa! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. So, we got Jared underneath the car, still grinding away because the bolt didn't want to come off. Yeah, I think I'm buying him lunch today. I already bought him breakfast. I think I owe The stuff one. you have to do for your friends. Yep. And I'm, I'm bringing supervising it. very well today. Oh, well, you got a little project going on, don't you, yeah, Matt? I'm, oh, yeah. I can't wait, wait for you to help me with the intercooler. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. wow. So, next step, we're going to bolt this all up. Jared's going to help. We might have to get some bolts, right? Yeah, we might have to go out and get some bolts. But, and a gasket. And a gasket. What, for whatever but, reason. Yeah, that's the one thing I will say, guys. If you're thinking about buying this kit, why can't you FS use, works. Why I don't know if maybe you guys messed up that. or just I, can, I can try reusing it. I don't like throwing an old gasket on. It's, it would be, guys, this is like a 50 cent item. It's just one of those things that they really just should have came with a new one, you know? So, because I don't know if the angle I put this on out here is what really has to go into the car. I think this is going to be your biggest. Yeah, it'll tighten it all, like just like. Pan yeah, I, I'm pretty much there. Pretty, it's ready to go. So, yeah. Oh man. Oh yeah! Woo! Woo! I I think you should just run it like that, Quinn. Yeah. Guys, big moment here, big moment. Come on, rev it! What? That was terrible. That was terrible. You want more? Yo, this John got hot. Give it! Back. Come on, let's go! Let's go! Guys, that's the install for the catback exhaust for the Ford Fiesta. I think it sounds pretty good. It's not over the top, which is what I wanted. Just something a little bit more than stock. Um, and if you like this video, be sure to check out the playlist at the very end. We're going to post a uh, playlist to all of our Fiesta videos. And as always, if you got a fast car, you better bring it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video. I'm going to link a couple more videos that if you like this one and you made it all the way to the end, you're going to definitely like these. So watch them, 
Also, that middle button right there, I think is probably, you know, somewhere in there. Hit that button to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more action.